How to set up LinkedIn Premium. So today I was doing some browsing on LinkedIn and looking up for some people in a new organization that I wanted to find out about. And I got this little message from LinkedIn. Your activity suggests you're using LinkedIn to recruit or generate leads. Retry premium free. So basically, you can search on LinkedIn as much as you want and then eventually they'll say, hold on, you're doing a lot of searching. Do you want premium? Which is what's happened here. So upgrade to get unlimited people browsing. So I'm going to click on retry premium free. And let's walk this, you through this, okay? Join millions of users using premium to get ahead one month free trial. So it's already selected that they think I want to use leads more effectively. And you can check, really look at any of these options, check, check whichever one you want. So if I click on next, it's taking me to Sales Navigator. Sales Navigator is a much more expensive plan than LinkedIn Business Premium. So if you click on Explore All Plans, it shows you more options. Career, Business, Sales Navigator Core or Recruiter Lite. So uh, I am not on LinkedIn for my career, so that is definitely not one that I want to look at, but this it tells you down below, it's $29.99 a month, and that will be if you paid it on the annual subscription. And that will give you five in meals a month, who's viewed your profile from the last 90 days, um, insights and LinkedIn learning courses. Now, here is a little tip. Do I actually need business? to grow and nurture my network because what I use LinkedIn Premium for is to see who's viewed my profile. I don't really use it in mails, um, but I do like LinkedIn learning courses. So I actually think that I might go for the $29.99 option. If we look at business, grow and nurture your network, what are the differences here? 15 in mails a month, see who's viewed your profile unlimited people browsing. That is what's pushing me up to the next level because when I'm doing training on LinkedIn, I want to be able to look at lots of different profiles um, to give my clients examples of people who look like them on LinkedIn. And I still get the LinkedIn learning courses and it's $34.99 when billed annually. I don't recommend you bill it annually because I quite like just stopping it for a while when I'm not really using it. So you've got all your FAQs down here. There is no refund policy. What? Well, sorry, there is a refund policy. You will not get a refund. Um, your membership automatically renews after seven days. You can cancel it uh, when you want, whenever you want. It's actually not that hard to cancel. You just go through a few steps. Uh, Sales Navigator Core. Sales Navigator is a completely different beast to um, the rest of LinkedIn. It gives you access to the Sales Navigator platform. We will look at that another day. You can save 10,000 leads, advanced lead search. It costs $83.99 a month when billed annually. Big, big difference. And then if you are a recruiter, of course, you can have Recruiter Lite. Uh, another platform again, access to your second and third degree networks, candidate searches. It's very, very much based on um, recruitment, obviously. And it is from £109 a month. So it is the most expensive. So I'm going to go with business because that is the best suited to my needs. If you're only interested in seeing who's viewed your profile and accessing LinkedIn Learning, then go for the career option. Um, it's only not much of a difference in terms of cost. So click on try for free and we are going to click on my profile and we're going to sign in. Secure checkout. So here we are. It's actually £53 a month. What happened to that 34 Where did it go? <laughs> I need to use this option, I guess. Uh, plus they've added that, of course. So I'm going to go here and it's $44.99 plus £9 VAT. 
which is $53.99 per month. I'm going to go down here. Um, you can set up your payment with PayPal, which actually is the easiest for me to do today. And from September the 24th, my payments will be $53.99 each month. Um, will I be charged during my free trial? No, I will not. And it's one month for free, not a week, a whole month for free. Yes, you can cancel during your free trial. However, they don't remind you that it's coming to the end. So bear that in mind. Set a date in your calendar um, and see, have I used it? Has it been of value to me? Do I want to keep it? Uh, and you can cancel it. Then, then it automatically charges you for the next month, okay? So start your free trial. Please do not refresh this page. And welcome to premium. Off we go. Um, step one, let's continue. Stay open to new opportunities with an open profile. So that means people who are not connected to you can connect with you. I have that set on. Click to continue. And um, stay private while browsing. Yes, I shall. So we can set this to private profile characteristics. That would say like um, marketing consultant Belfast. Your name and headline would say Louise Brogan, LinkedIn consultant. I am using private mode because that will give us anonymous searching on LinkedIn. Check out the video I have all about how to use LinkedIn anonymously. And then make the most of premium. So basically, go to my premium will walk us through all of the other features. And if we click on the home screen, yes, I'm going to close the tour. Thank you so much, LinkedIn. Um, and we go to my profile here. You'll see the little gold sign has reappeared, which shows that I have premium. And I'll just show you, this is the bit that I like the best. Profile views, who has viewed your profile. Down here, we can see the names of the people and where they work, who have viewed my profile. Do you know what? I've kind of missed that in the last few months. So that is definitely worth getting back. All right, any questions on that, please pop them below. And if you have, um, please subscribe to the channel for um, more content on how to use LinkedIn for business.